Thank you for joining us for Real Estate in the Low Country. I'm Betsy McDaniel. Let's get started with a few of the latest headlines. With states just now beginning to reopen, much is still unknown about the economic recovery from COVID-19 and how that will take shape. However, there might be a bit of a bright spot on the horizon. For obvious reasons, home purchase applications began dropping in mid-March and they continued to fall through April. But the Mortgage Bankers Association's Purchase Index, a regular pulse check of buyer interest in residential real estate, has reported that for a third week in a row, buyer interest has ticked up. Although it was a modest increase of about 7% for the week ending May 1st, it is seen as an indication of a pent-up demand for home buying. A couple of years ago, preliminary plans for an extended stay America hotel in Okatee received some pushback from nearby residents who feared an increase in crime and lower property values. So much so, in fact, that nearly 400 of them signed a petition calling for officials to reject the plan. The plan was not rejected, and on April 29th, the four-story, 120-room hotel celebrated its grand opening. Meant to cater to business travelers, it is also near the Encompass Health Rehabilitation Hospital. Amenities include a kitchen, an on-site laundry room, fitness center, and is pet-friendly. For the past year or so, neighborhood kids have used a mound of dirt that sits in the heart of the historic district as a bike ramp. What if Bluffton-based developer Matthew Cunningham gets his vision for the bridge at Calhoun approved? There will soon be a restaurant, six retail spaces, 12 residential units, and a 58-space parking lot on that very spot. Many residents are vehemently opposed as they feel the buildings will take the history out of Old Town. For his part, Cunningham wants residents to know that he lives here and has a vested interest in making it sure it is a nice place to live and work. The town's Historic Preservation Committee has asked for several changes before final approval would be given. Check out the media sources on your screen for more information on these and other stories and check us out on Facebook and Twitter as well. Much more to come, so don't go away.